everyone, so today we are doing a very sentimental video that I'm sure I'll look back on and cry. But that day is not right now because there's just a lot of work to do. <laughs> today we are transforming the studio spaces that I've created into basically house staging because we're going to be selling the studio so i don't want it to look like a studio because then people will be confused so i'm going to be taking basically all the lighting down all the equipment out all the little you know the little staged bits down and we're going to be bringing in some staging furniture from the house flip that we did and if you watched going through the storage unit i was setting aside things to stage the studio so that's what we're going to be doing today i am kind of sad about it but i also just got access to the new place and i love it and you guys will be seeing the house tour very soon if not already have seen it Okay, with how busy I've been lately, I guess I forgot to do the charity portion in this video when I was originally filming, but no big deal. I'll just do it now. Pick charity. Okay, today's charity is Kalsa Aid. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. I'll go over on their website and tell you guys about it. Kalsa Aid is an international NGO with the aim to provide humanitarian aid in disaster areas and civil conflict zones around the world. So this, along with all the other ones you guys submitted, looks like a great charity. So that will be the charity for today. We'll get back to the video. Okay, but I'm just gonna show you guys the rooms really quick, what they look like before, if you haven't watched the studio tour. It's a little bit messy in here right now, just because we are mid-move whilst also filming. So please ignore the mess. Okay, so here is the room we were just sitting in. This is my sit down room. And the backdrop that you guys see in almost every intro of the video is right here. Before when I moved in, this was a closet and I ripped it out. So I think we're gonna stage this room as an office. We have all of this lighting bolted to the ceiling that we have to get out. And then also all of this um, soundproofing on the wall. I gotta get that out. But uh, I love this room. <laughs> But again, someone else will like it. Another family, hopefully, will appreciate this place like I did. Okay, and then we have this room. Now, as you can see, there's already like lots of stuff taken out of here. I'll flip to the footage of that really quick because we already have done a little bit in here. Okay, you guys, this is the first room we're gonna clear out. I probably mentioned that. This is actually like, we're time traveling right now because this is way in the past as to when I was filming this, but my dad and Tate are gonna take this and this bookshelf, so we're just gonna clear everything off of it and we'll pack it up later. Back to the future. We've got again lighting and the soundproofings on this side of this room. I think this is going to be either staged as a bedroom or an office. It does actually have a closet, so probably a bedroom. I'm honestly so excited to see what this looks like as a normal house because I've always been kind of curious. If I didn't turn into a studio, how would it look? Okay, this room is a mess right now. In the studio tour, this room probably looked a lot better, but it's a mess right now. I I have lots of clothes all over the floor. I got my main camera in here. Again, all the lighting. I try very hard at my audio and lighting, although sometimes I know it doesn't seem like it because it's not that good, but I have been trying. This is another part of this room that I'm really excited to see what it looks like as a real bedroom. It's kind of a tight squeeze here, you guys. This is my gaming room. You know, if you watch my second channel, this is gonna be a very glamorous closet because I'm gonna obviously leave this wallpaper up. So if the new box Fire likes this wallpaper. I mean, I would leave it. Who doesn't want wallpaper in their closet? But okay, so those are all of the sets that we're gonna be tackling in the next little while. You're probably gonna see many different outfits because this will take more than a day. I have a whole week allotted for us to be transforming these because once everything's taken down, then we're gonna bring in the new furniture and set it up. It's gonna be quite a long process, but I always feel like a staged house sells better. Coming up here pretty quick, I have the finishing of my gum surgery. If you guys saw that, it's like I had, um, what is it called? Recession, so I got it built up and now I have to get it pulled up and more skin put there, whatever. So if I look a little bit rough at some point in this video, it's probably because it was after my dental surgery <laughs> or just I look rough, I don't know. Okay, but let's get transforming this place. Let's go. 
<laughs> okay, you guys, so since this room already has the furniture moved out, we're gonna start here and start taking everything off of the roofs. The roofs, the roof only one singular and everything off of the walls these are coming with to the new studio we'll just take them right over there probably pretty quick here may as well since we have it now so this will be a minute for sure <laughs> So I'm just following this cord. Oh, there's one more. They're all tied together. Oh, there we go. Unplug. Ba -da -da. <laughs> da -da 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 -da. The first thing is down. There we go. Now I just have to take the rest down. You know, I never really, oh, hi. <laughs> you know, I never really noticed this, but this one's actually falling out already, so. It was coming down. Second one, down. These are taking a lot less time to take down than they did to put them up, I'll tell you that much. Stay strong down there. <laughs> Yay! And then those little hook things at the back. Okay, that's loosening. Which way? This way, you think? I think that's that's think the way that's normally loosening. What's <laughs> happening with that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh my gosh, this room feels huge. Okay, so you guys, now we're just taking off the soundproofing, which you basically just pop it off, and then this is on the wall. Yeah, then there's just gonna be a lot of filling. Okay, now we will do this room. Kind of the same exact thing. I'm excited to see how big this room looks because this is kind of the smallest room. Goodbye, lighting. I love you. Because <laughs> your head wasn't <laughs> This box is in my way. Because <laughs> that thing is too powerful. Turning it out. Out. Why is it not coming out? It's because it's a long. It is how long? <laughs> like, look at how far it is from the wall already. I literally have water dripping down my back. Look how long that was. <laughs> I have no idea why this song was stuck in my head. The new room. Word. Word. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Oh that feels better. It looks horrible though. It has so <laughs> much holes in the wall. Yeah. See, this is what I'm talking about. And that, yeah. That, I have you no. Know, okay, I need to stop. <laughs> Okay. 
Oh, am I wrong to do that? Isn't that how they come off? Maybe I did the safety screw. Oh, we did. Okay. The thing right here. Right. I brought you a snack. <laughs> I brought a gift for you. the big room. You can probably hear the AC's bussing right now and we're just gonna leave it bussing because it's hot. Okay. Okay. Just going up. Last room. There we go. Okay. <laughs> it's all gonna come down. Oh no. I did a bad <laughs> Oh, 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 my. oh, you rat. It fell. Oh, no. Don't my fingers. Yeah. Okay, Dad, we have a problem. Oh, we have this one screw. screw in the corner. It's right. being very, very oh, nasty. Wow, it's really in there? Yes. <laughs> oh, oh my God. Not moving. Nope. <laughs> Don't go falling off. Can I get that? Um, okay, you guys, here is that room with everything off the roof. This one is less of a moment because there's still so much stuff in here. But that is all we're going to be doing for today. So I will see you after my surgery. Wish me luck. Ooh. Hi, everyone. I got grafting done, which is basically like a dental surgery procedure where they take skin from in your mouth and sew it over your gums when you have recession. But it hurts a little bit to chat, but I think I'll be able to do some packing. And also, I wanna fill these holes in this wall because where we last left off, everything's been removed from the ceiling and the walls. And the walls are looking a little bit rough. And I also got to pack up all of my camera equipment and some of the makeup from in the other room. Whew, sorry, I'm a little out of breath. Okay, but I think I'll start by filling this wall because I'm in this room. Here's what the wall looks like close up. So obviously not in the best condition to sell the house. So we're just gonna fill this up, but don't ever be scared of putting holes in your wall because it's a really easy fix. You guys will see. Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna put my ice pack back on. This is a face mask. I'm innovative. That's what this is. Shall we? We shall. So what I'm doing just to start, also I know I look busted, but it's just the way it goes. The move doesn't stop for this grafting appointment. But I'm just taking polyfilla and just starting by just filling the cracks. So now the first coat's all done in all the rooms and the first room that I did is already ready for a sand. I kind of don't think all of them will need a second coat, but sometimes if it's a really big hole that you're filling, it might need a second. 
<laughs> okay, mom, do you want to tell them about your awesome idea? <laughs> okay, my idea is because it's a popcorn ceiling and we have a ton of holes to fill in the ceiling and it's already like textury, I thought we'd use like a piping bag and make it like it's icing and try and like. <laughs> there. We might be onto something because we can fill nail holes and everything with this. <laughs> now watch the end come flying off. It feels like icing. <laughs> Honestly. Oh! Oh my gosh! It, I think it's gonna work. Oh yeah. I think so too. <laughs> oh my gosh, if this works, I'm gonna be so happy. <laughs> okay. So I'll first fill the hole. I think it's gonna look great. Oh, Mia! Oh my god, it looks great! Like, I can't even see it! Oh my god! It looks great! Oh, yeah, you cannot tell, right? You cannot. It worked! What a good idea! I am so impressed with how this place is shaping up again. I think all the holes are out. We did it. We did it. While my mom does that, I'm going to pack up these, oh, pack up these cabinets. Today I'm going to be painting. Now, the problem with the studio is there are three different shades of white amongst various rooms. So yesterday I tested the white that I thought was in here, right here, and it dried and it was the right white. So that's good. I have one room figured out. All of our painting clothes are packed, so I have to be careful. So what I like to do when I'm covering this is I like to do like a thin coat and then try to wash up the edges a little bit just so that you can't see where you repainted like it all just like flows into the wall you know it's a good sign when you can't really tell where you need to cover Okay you guys, this is the room I'm most excited to paint over because as you can see, this spray adhesive, it looks like really yellow on the wall because it is really yellow. So I'm gonna roll over this. I actually had to go out and buy this paint again to do this. This is cloud white. This is what this whole place is basically painted it, with a few exceptions. So that was the confusing part, finding these whites. Got this little roller. Oh my gosh, it looks great. It's covering it so nice. So my roller is not rolling. <laughs> this is not how a roller is supposed to roll. All right, a big roller this time. Oh yeah, it's rolling. Got to go. This is so satisfying, you guys. <laughs> Going over this terrible yellow on the wall. All right, you guys, the first coat of paint is still drying, but it looks so much better now. Like seriously, the ceiling, the light fixture's now in. 
It's looking better. Now I just gotta do the same thing to the flamingo room. Because as you guys can see, this room also has the yellow on it. So we gotta get that gone. been a couple hours and the rooms are now officially painted they're still drying a little bit so if it looks a little blotchy still that's why but honestly like in comparison to what it was before this looks so much better the flamingo room is looking really good as well all the holes are filled the ceilings looking right and then in this room it's also looking good this one definitely had the biggest holes in the ceiling to fill so if i really look i can see it but i feel like you'd have to know they were there but like this is looking great the painting is all done and now i'm just touching up a little bit on the main floor but i won't worry about showing that because it's pretty much the same thing and it's a little repetitious i think now we just gotta clean it up and get some staging stuff in here i'm so excited to stage it up and actually see what this place looks like as a real house i'll be back to stage okay wait this is why i was feeling so confused as to why i went so quickly i still need to pack up this and I also need to pack up my gaming room today and also all the clothing in here, but I'll do that off camera. <laughs> it just had to rain. It had to rain on staging day. <sighs> it's raining <laughs> all over everything. As you can see, the rain has had a little bit of havoc on our day, but that's okay. Everything will dry. I just want to see this thing in all its glory. Are you ready to build a bed with no instructions? Kind of scared. We should be getting good at this. Do you think? Here is all the hard where we saved mom. <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. Isn't that nice? Well, let's just get started because we yeah. know how to put it together. That good. We really did that. <laughs> Wait, what the heck? Why is it so tall? Hang on. Hang um, on a second. <laughs> hang on. <laughs> Wait, could this be for the pink bed? Oh, 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 that's for that. This is for the pink bed. Right, yeah. <laughs> and then just oh, oh, Lisa. Oh, oh no. Here. What's happening? <laughs> 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 I should have cut my nails. <laughs> okay, okay. Don't fall down the stairs. Okay, now I'll lift and go in the bed. Here, I'll help you lift. That's okay, it's not that heavy. I'd rather you not lift after your dental surgery. <laughs> surgery, surgery. <laughs> there, we did it. We did it! Oh, yeah! Nice! <gasps> it's a real room. It is a real room. It looks great. <laughs> Okay, you guys, so that's this room. I'm just gonna take a break to eat, and then we'll do some decorating. Oh, and this room's gonna be an office, so I'll do that in a sec. We're fed. This is gonna be an office. This actually could be a bedroom. I'm just gonna make it an office, because I, <laughs> I feel like it. Hopefully, whoever sees this place and they need three bedrooms, they can visualize it enough to know it's a bedroom. Chick, you look great in your sweater, buddy. Yeah, I was just standing in <laughs> What? What? I mean, it's... <laughs> and I kind of blanked up. <laughs> Visualize. 
you know why I said it now? Nice. <laughs> Thank I'm you. I'm sorry. I just zoned right out. a designated office. I would actually, if I was using that as an office, I think I'd love it like that. Chippy, you would look good in here. Chippy, you're a little model for this room. You're so beautiful. You look great in this room. Smile for the camera, Chip. You let me know what you think of it. Oh my gosh, it's perfect. Yeah? It's at, yeah. Do you want me to hold it up for you to see it? Sure. Oh yeah, I think that's a cute office. Okay, you guys, so this is the living room. We did a little bit of filling and just like emptying this out, which you guys probably saw in the moving out video. So now it's basically, well, it's not empty now. It was empty an hour ago, and then we brought all the staging furniture in. So we're gonna try and situate it to look nice. I'm thinking like a little sectional here. Chip. So a little sectional here, and then we're thinking maybe of putting the desk here, and then we have a few things to hang. I don't know, we're just gonna move some stuff around and see how it looks. Anything will be better than what it once looked like. You guys probably can remember. It was terrible. <laughs> Everything he thinks is like a game. It's not a game. <laughs> like she's trying to get it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Ah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So you want me to pull the rug out? Pull it out. It's okay. Chippy, okay. what are you doing, okay, baby? One, two, three. Okay. subscriber because this used to be in that room when that was the stand-up room so it's kind of fun oh my gosh is it close it's really close yeah it's good okay I see. think it's really good. What do you think? Um, why would you okay this? You gotta <laughs> Oh god, mom, no. <laughs> Sun's happening. We're having our downfall right now. Yeah. I could just shoot it in one a little lower. Should I just make another hole? Yeah, why don't you? Thank you, yeah. Yeah, it's it's good, Mia. Okay, yeah, you you've got it. <laughs> you got it! I think they're so good. That's everything to be hung, I think. Okay, you guys, we were just starting putting the decor pieces out. We have tons of decor that we set aside here, and it's looking so good. We're literally loving it so much. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's the decor is like really completing the whole look. <laughs> <laughs> and like Chip is really liking it too. He thinks it looks so good. <laughs> Mom, what do you think of the decor? It's perfect. <laughs> it literally like the colors pop so well. Mm -hmm. Just wait till he sees. Yeah. We it's all for him. He loves the new decor. He rules the house, so he might as well have all the decor that he wants. <laughs> 
Okay, you guys, it's actually the day after. We went a little crazy yesterday, as you probably can remember. So we're going to start with the decorating. Okay, now this is pillow time. Yeah, I'll stand watching. <laughs> you okay. She's working her magic. <laughs> there she goes. <laughs> oh my gosh. Cute, right? You nailed it. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my god. It looks so cute. It looks amazing. I'm not hating how low it is either. Yeah, it looks very welcoming. Let's do lamps. I think it looks adorable. <laughs> okay, same situation in here. You guys may be noticing it's pink explosion, just the way I like it. And Chip likes it too. This is the fun room. This room is easy to love. Pink fluffy flamingos and donuts. <laughs> What's not to love? Honestly, true. I'll show off that beautiful touch. <laughs> Very nice. Perfect. <laughs> yes, mom. <laughs> Who wouldn't want to work in here? <laughs> Complete. I think it looks pretty cute. I think it looks like really cute. So that has been transforming this place from a full-blown studio with lights hanging from the ceiling to now a three bedroom, well one is an office, but a three bedroom house. I love the way the staging looks. It makes me not want to move <laughs> out of it because I'm like, oh, it looks so functional, looks so cute. It's nice and clean. There's fresh paint. Like I could live here. And I just think back to the way it looked before. It functioned really well as a studio, but honestly, it didn't look as good as it does now like this looks better i definitely think this will have a better chance selling looking like this and staged like this than how i had it before so in the past i've received comments before that are like oh you ruined it transforming it into a studio you destroyed this house and first of all it functioned very well as a studio and it was an amazing workspace for me and i don't regret having this as a studio at all i loved it and i can't wait for my next studio i'm gonna do like a very similar thing to the next house but i hope this video showed you guys that you can also transform it back to a house because i definitely think that this looks like a normal house now. Like nobody would know unless they saw this video. They're not gonna know that this was a studio. So shh, be, shh, don't say anything. Hopefully you guys liked seeing how we transformed it. I think we have to say goodbye to the studio. It's actually officially gone, but we can say bye now like this. Goodbye. <laughs> Also, be sure to comment down below if you guys like the way that we staged it or which room was your favorite. And as always, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I appreciate you guys so much. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!